Hey guys, good morning. Happy Thursday, December 8th. Um, to, this morning I have my proctor exam for the food handlers safety course. Um, it is at 9 and so I have to log in 20 minutes ahead of time. So I've got about 10 minutes here, a little over 10 minutes. I'm going to try and brush up on a few things that I'm not sure about, but I thought I would open up my yarn for today real quick. Because why not? I had to put these up high, as you saw, because Alfie tried, kept trying to get them last night. So I had to make it more of a challenge for him. Oh, that's beautiful. Turkish Delight Liqueur. Oh, man. Whoops. That is lovely. The lighting in here isn't the best. But look how pretty. We're up to eight lovely little things of yarn. Oh, so pretty. Look at those beauties. Well, I better get studying. A little nervous about the test. It's been a long time since I've had to take a test. So, <laughs> praying that this goes well. So, <laughs> talk to you again soon. Thank you, Lord. <laughs> I got a little bit chilly while I was just sitting there, although like I couldn't get up or it, since it was proctored, they were like watching me through the video. So I wasn't allowed to like get up or anything. I couldn't even have a drink there. I couldn't have a watch on. It was like, and I had to like spin the camera to show them the room. Like, I don't know, it's kind of crazy, but um, yeah, it's done. Yay. But I was just going to mention my um, cowl I have on here. This is the candy cane cowl. It was designed by my friend Victoria. Um, she is the Teasel Cottage Mouse on Instagram. Currently, I'm not in on Instagram, by the way. Like, I am still on there as Miss Strawberry Short Girl, but I just deleted it off my phone for at least a little bit. Sometimes I do that just to kind of take a break from it. Anywho, um, the yarn is Prancer by Biff Sugar Yarns, held together with some Surrey Alpaca, um, and it is super cozy and I love it. So, just thought I mentioned that. And then as I was looking out the window, I have to show you this. So Alfie is still living in the garage. I bring him in at night to snuggle just because, you know, it's it cold at night. You know, I like to snuggle him, but he likes to look out this window and watch the birdies. So, the squirrels and things. I just thought you'd think that was funny. <laughs> Wolfie! Yeah, he can't hear me, of course. So, I just was talking to my camera and it was not recording. So, that's fun. Um, basically, in essence, I said um, that Alfie is a part-time outside cat and part-time inside at night cat. So... Anywho, once I'm married and at my house, um, he'll probably be inside again, but he's probably gonna wanna go outside all the time now that he's gotten used to that. But um, yeah, so I was just saying too that the exam took less than an hour. So, and that was pretty much the only thing I really had planned for today. So my day has kind of opened up. So I'm thinking about going to the thrift stores and if I go, I'll take you with me. <laughs> I decided the thrift stores would be a good idea. Let's go. First things first, gotta have a coffee. Oh, my first stop was successful. I'll show you what I got in more detail later. I'm at my second stop, taking off my coat this time because I was getting hot in the other store. And yeah, just coming in the car. So let's see what we find. Hey guys, I'm back home. I ended up stopping and having lunch with Mariah. So I showed him everything I got too. So let me unpack it and show you guys what I got. Got a little bit at each store. 
three different stores. Okay, so at the first store, got four vintage pillowcases, Christmas. This is my favorite. So um, there's two of each kind, so a set of each one. This cute was the night before Christmas. And then this cute Santa's. Now he's a little faded, um, but overall the fabric's in really good condition. I may actually end up selling this set, um, but I'll probably keep this set because I love it. So, and then also the set of vintage cookie cutters in the box. That was so cute. Sugar Plum Cookie Cutters by Wilton. The old price was $2.95 and I paid $5, but just thought it was cute. And the pink Wilton box, happy with those. And then a vintage Christmas kitchen towel. This one's probably from like the 80s or 90s, but I really liked it. And then a puzzle, a Coca-Cola puzzle, just for fun. Um, Ryan and I put together a puzzle the other night just for the fun of it, and so I thought that one would be fun to try. And then, um, actually I'll come back to these. So uh, a flannel shirt for Mariah, and then a vintage flannel 90 for me. Uh, I'm guessing it's probably 80s or 90s, but it's my favorite color, yay! And then this fun belt, it is actually kind of small. It's more pink than it's showing in the picture. It's kind of fun rainbowy colors. Um, it fits my waist, so it'd be cute like over a dress. And then, oh, I already showed you that. And then um, these birthday candle holders in the original little container. How cute are they? For 20 cents, kind of cast that up. These sweet little note cards, they are super tiny. For 15 cents couldn't kind of pass those up got this for my sister amy it's like a perpetual calendar just for december but it is cherished teddies which she um really likes cherished teddies and then this little tray wonder if any of you know what it's for it is old tupperware and it was only a dollar it's hard plastic and it's my favorite color I thought it'd just be good for like sewing notions or things like that. Really anything. Since it was a good color, I couldn't pass it up. And it was just cool that it was Tupperware. But I wonder if it like went in a case or something. Because uh, it's kind of got some, some pieces that look like it would set on something. I don't know. And it's got little feet. So this is not the best camera work here. So I do apologize. But yeah. Happy with my little haul today, yay! I think I'm gonna settle down with uh, Mariah's Christmas present, maybe catch up on some Vlogmases. Um, yeah, so I've been catching up on Taylor S Studios and I need to catch up on uh, Stitch by Mrs. D too because I only wa watched the first couple days of that so far. But yeah, looking forward to a nice quiet afternoon working on that. Now that the, the um, test, my exam is behind me, I feel a weight of relief. <laughs> Talk to you again soon.